everyone. Happy Sephora Play Bag Day. All right, so jumping into last month's, everything came in this super cute bag. The bags are always adorable. I love it. All right, so I did like okay with trying all the products last month. Um, first thing was the professional. I didn't open the sample. I have a full size one going. It is my all time favorite primer, so I already knew that. Next was this primer from First Aid Beauty, the Coconut Skin Smoothing Priming Moisturizer, and I really liked this. It gave your skin a little bit of a glow, and it was moisturizing. So I would definitely um, use this again. It smells really good like coconut, and I love that. Um, I do prefer more of like this kind of where it fills in your pores a little bit more for the T-zone, but if I'm like spending a long time, sometimes I do like this in the T-zone and this all over the rest of the place and that kind of stuff, and that's fun. That's like way too much for your everyday. All right, next was this Kat Von D liquid lipstick in K-Dub, and I never wore this. There just was never an occasion where I was really wanting to wear a bright pink lipstick, um, but I definitely will try it someday. I love that formula, so that's not the issue. Next was the perfume sample was the Black Opium by um, YSL, and this was nice. I did feel like it was a little bit strong, um, but I did like it. It was just one of those ones where you only really want like one spray. Uh, next was the Way Rose Hair and Body Oil. I only used this on my hair, and I concentrated it mostly on the ends because I didn't want it to get greasy. It does smell really nice. Um, I didn't really notice much of a difference. I just thought it was nice. And then the last thing was this Rich Kid Coconut Oil Gel, and I didn't use this because I had a little mishap where I dropped all of my hair stuff, and like in the process of putting it all away, this one got caught up in the, like, I've already used these. These are like regular products versus the samples I'm trying to try these out right now products. Um, I have them in different areas just so that I use the samples, and um, this one got put in the wrong area, so I never used it because I was pulling from the samples. So, um, not for lack of desire trying this, I just missed it. All right, so moving on to this month, and it says Beauty Staycation. <gasps> Look at how cute it says Glamp Out. Oh, I love it. It looks like a picnic. So cute. All right, first thing is perfume sample, Orange Sanguine by Atler Cologne. I'm pretty sure we've had this one before. We've definitely had this brand a few times and I feel like we've actually had this scent as well. So that's interesting. Maybe we haven't. It smells good, it's fruity and fresh smelling. So that's exciting. Next is, oh, ooh, the Superhero Mascara by It. I've been wanting to try this. Oh, that's so exciting. I haven't never tried this one. And I've heard people really like it. Ooh, looks like a nice bristly brush. Love it, they're really close together. Looks like it's wet, but doesn't look too wet. Hopefully it's not clumpy. I'm so excited to try that. I love trying mascaras. So exciting. All right, next is, ooh, Bare Minerals Gen Nude Matte in the color Swag. That's exciting. I have two of these, I think, but I don't know what colors I have. And I love them. They're so fun. So this one is a really pretty, they're all nudes, but it's like a rosy nude. Oh, I love it. That is so pretty. I smell good like cake. Mm. All right, next is, ooh, the Bosha Charcoal Pore Pudding um, Intensive Wash Off Treatment. I've actually tried this in a really little sample. I think I had gotten it with like a 100 point perk or something from Sephora, but it was years ago. So I'm excited to try this again. I love masks and treatments, and I love how fun this one looks, kind of like a zebra. And then next is Rio Geo, um, ooh, it's a leave-in conditioning spray. I'm not even going to try to say it. 
That's exciting. I use a lot of leave-in conditioning sprays because I have really thick and tangly hair, so I love this kind of product. And this brand usually has really good scents. Usually like light and sweet. And then last thing is ooh, Milk Makeup. It is the cooling water. Interesting. So it actually has like a bluish tint to it. I don't have a smell. Ooh, and it feels very cooling. So I'm going to have to look it up and see what you're supposed to use it for, but that's exciting. Cool. I love getting the Milk um, Makeup samples because I haven't bought anything. And since it's sort of new, it's like fun to try it. All right, well, that is everything that I got in this month's Sephora Playbacks. As always, thank you guys so much for watching, and I hope you have a wonderful day.